We have announcements today from automakers representing nearly the entire auto industry market who have, who have positioned around the ambition of 40 to 50 percent of all vehicles sold by 2030 in America being electric. This is a big deal. But to unlock the full potential, we have to keep investing in our workers and our manufacturing capacity. And that's what our Build Back Better plan is all about. It's about leveraging once-in-a-generation investments and a whole-of-government effort to lift up American auto workers and strengthen, and strengthen the American leadership in the world in the clean car technology, trucks, and not just cars, but trucks as well, and buses. You know, that's why today I'm signing an executive order setting out a target of 50 percent of all passenger vehicles sold by 2030 will be electric and set into motion an all-out effort. I made clear what I've long believed and I think of when I think of the climate crisis. Beyond the devastation of the lives and livelihoods and the health of our very planet, when I hear climate, I think jobs, good-paying union jobs. I wanted the world to see there was a consensus that all that, — that we're at an inflection point in world history. If we act to save the planet, we can also come out of it better. We can create millions of good-paying jobs that generate significant economic growth and opportunity, raise the standard of living for people not only here but around the world. But I also wanted to put the world on notice. America is back. America is back.